Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Armageddon YGO versus APJ, and this is going to be a post mama replay. Also, you can go ahead and check out Armageddon YGO, link down below at the top of the description. Let's hop right in. We're gonna see APJ win the rock, paper, scissors, shoot, and go first 50 versus 40. Opening hands, we have Talons, Heartbeat, Miri, Super Poly, and Shaylin. They have Jet, Red, Temple, Miri, and Super Poly. So they're gonna go main phase, activate. So they're playing tier, spray, brave. They're on 50, so I wanna say that they're actually playing a lot of tiers. And this isn't just like one for maybe like milling temple or runic spells. Uh, so temple in the right, and then activate right, bring out the token, and then bring out fateful, normal summon Miri, fateful effect, go grab Draco back, and then fateful effect to go search Griffin grab griffin and then discard draco back draco back effect to equip chain griffin also my eyes are tweaking i don't know why everything's just like so bright uh bring out draco back special summon jet jet effect goes search how they're gonna search starter or smashers and we are gonna grab smashers and then link off going to sprint sprint effect to dump I'm guessing that dumps Miri. Yeah, I was gonna say since that gets us into like our tier stuff. He could dump Angler and get more level twos. But put those back, bring out Kekalos, and then Kekalos effect to search. Yeah, it grabs Rhino. And then kit tag out in the Rhino. And then Rhino one, kit two. So I'm guessing we're keeping red in hand for the super poly. We don't plan on going for a Garua. Mel Shaylin. Angler, which can bring out beavers. We're gonna hard dump Miri. Um, may as well just get that in there if we plan on ending on Elf or something. And then Shaylin one, Hafinas two, Angler three. Oh, we're gonna have enough space. Yes, summon one beaver, put back Hafinas, Kikalos. Then that brings out Rue Kalos, put back Shaylin, Rhino, bring out Kick Kalos, and then Overlay, go for Gigantic, Gigantic Effect, so it attach and go special, bring out Ibli. Alright, Ibli is pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. This card is tough to beat, a lot of people aren't prepared for it. And because of that, it's really good. But we also saw some people being you know very prepared for it um in that post mama tournament that was hosted by luxury and decade and then special regs we have the link and then go for ip set smasher set super poly okay so we're gonna ha have griffin interruption recalis interruption uh elf can summon back miri or red and then ip interruption smashers interruption uh could even could even make Super Poly alive, depending on how the turn goes, because you could go for Miri, Mill Tier, make Kick Kalos if you play two. Um, you could also just bring out Jet and Search, and that's something for Super Poly. Draw Terraforming, and then Standby Phase. They, they even main deck it. They don't even side deck the Ling Rebo. It is their game one. All right, fair enough. That is very good. That definitely hurts the opponent's end board, because... We're just taking off the floodgate from our field. Then go terraforming, terraforming, go search planet. It's not like it's not even like they were trying to protect it to the fullest though, because you know they could have gone beat cop protect it. They could have summoned it, you know, under the extra monster zone, protected it, but they didn't. And then they're gonna go planet. And then chain griffin negate. Go ahead, shuffle back, destroy. And then activate talents to take, no response. So we're gonna chain super poly to use Rukalos and IP, bring out Dragos to Paleo. And then we get to take elf, new chain link, Rukalos one, elf two, target Miri. That's pretty good, they can't, smashers, they don't have anything. And then Miri effect, mill three, hits Rhino, Solik. So we're going to go Rhino 1, Solik 2, even gain the chain block. I have a target. Yep. <laughs> Do you have a legal target? Don't worry. Me no cheat. 
grab Pofinos. I love when people ask me that because I either do one of two things. I'll be like, yeah, I have a target or I'll just be like, uh, how, how else would I activate it without a target in hand? And they'd be like, oh, well, you can't unless you have a target. And it's like, yeah, that's, I'm activating it because I have a target in hand. I know how to activate my cards or I don't know. Because I, I like, it's such a dumb thing, but like, you'll see a lot of people ask. And even I've asked sometimes just because like, you don't know. Your opponent really could just be a bot and really just don't know that. Like, I had an opponent, uh, top cut of PPG. They went chaos base, discard to go search. And I was like, do you have a target? Cause, and, uh, cause I stopped it and they were like, yeah, I had a target. And I was like, okay, fair enough. And then middle of the game found out their target was like gamma or something. Like obviously something you can't search off chaos space. And then they got the game was. So like, you know, sometimes you really just do be asking. Discard a Phoenix, bring out Rhino, new chain link. Yeah, they admit the feed. They realize they lost. They can't win that. On to the next game, we're going to see APJ go first. Opening hands, we got Planet, Terraforming, Roto, Super Poly, Soli, because I play Mystic Mind. That could be good. Um, they have Griffin, Red, Heartbeat, Wright, and Shaylin. Also, Griffin to gate on Planet, and then just activate another Planet. Could be fine. So, activate Wright, bring out the token, bring out Fateful, Special Summon Griffin, and then activate Fateful Effect, go search Draco back, and then Fateful Effect, go search Temple. And then we're going to discard Draco back, Draco back effect to equip, Shaylin effect. So Shaylin is going to summon out by discarding Temple, mill 3, and then normal summon red. Use those, make sprint. Also, this isn't even post mama. Oh, I just realized that. Yeah, I was like, oh, that's crazy how I didn't catch it till now. All right, we'll let this one slip through. This is going to be the last replay that's not post-mama. I was just thinking about that. I was like, wait, why is there a Rota in our hand? This card's horrible. We have way too many normal summons. And I was like, wait, we didn't see a single Ishizu. So, yeah, but now they're going to make Sprint, Sprint effect, dump Miri, Miri effect. All right, one slip through, one slip through. Bring out Kikalos, Kikalos effect, go search Miri. Yeah, usually I like check this before I start recording. I have to, bro. I get sent so many singles and it's like, I'm not going to post singles, bro. This just aren't real. Bring out Miri and then kit one, Miri two, go ahead, mill eight. Uh, Grief adds back a banished trap, crime adds back a banished tier monster. So we're going to only mill Hafina's, I guess blue there, and then Hafina's effect. Putting back itself in Kikalos. Then bring out Garua. Overlay, Gigantic. Gigantic effect. Detach. Go special summon out the Angler. Alright, you know, set it out Ibli because our opponent has an out. Go for Elf. Elf effect. Bring out from the graveyard. And then we can get Jet effect to search. And then Jet, go grab Smashers. Now link off. IP. Garua draw. And then that draws into planet. Oh, it's so good. Now we just activate planet. Planet goes search. Could grab, let's see, could grab Hafinas. Uh, we also have Heartbeat that can discard it at any point. You, all, you don't have to target an opponent spell trap with this. Uh, it's also, this is good to out your own Mystic Mind, but you could use this. Um, you could like shuffle back Draco back, discard Hafinas, get Hafinas effect, and then you could also chain block multiple times because you'd have planet chain block you'd have fateful chain block to search draco back but past turn draw scream good card by the way good card scream activate terraforming and then terraforming go grab planet yeah Myst mystic might be very awkward into a heartbeat smasher draco back and board but they're gonna heartbeat target planet shuffle it back hafina's effect put back hafina's and garua Bring out Dragostapalia. Um, Alright, battle phase. So that way, you know, they chose to not use IP. They chose to not use Elf. Discard the planet that we couldn't use until next turn. Because, you know, it's uh, activation was not negated. Bring out Dragostapalia. Attack Elf. Activate Smashers. And then, let's see, we could chain Dragostapalia. Target Griffin. Uh, they're not going to chain, obviously. Is this, this isn't even negated because that's not on board. Activate Rota. Could scare him, though. 
Rota, go grab Rhino, so they're going to negate the, try to negate the graveyard effect of whatever that dumps, but we do have Scream, so we're able to activate Scream, normal Rhino, Rhino 1, Scream 2, this doesn't tell them the card in our hand is a tier card, if we did it the other way around, they'd probably be able to, you know, know that, uh, we have all three tiers in graveyard now, so Shaylin 1, Hafinas 2, Chain Griffin, I love it when, I, when I'm in this scenario where I have all these tier effects, and I know, like, I want my opponent to negate. Because if my opponent negates, then, like, I just play so freely. Like, I don't have to worry about interruptions anymore. So now I can, like, I can just see the, the whole line and try to get there. Um, where if they don't negate, then it's like, okay, well, where do I think they're going to negate now? And, you know, you can, I mean, it wouldn't really be hard to play around here. I mean, it's just Griffin. Griffin negates kind of not the greatest. Uh, activate Kikalos, you know, if you want to Griffin negate this, sure, grab Heartbeats, effect target itself, bring out Miru, and then mill 8, uh, so the only one we haven't used is the Miri, we're gonna go Solik, Scream, just adjust those, no Scream, so there's no target, uh, go search Hofinas, and then, a little misclick on their side, uh, go in the Sprint, Sprint effect, dump Miri, Miri effect, put back itself, Huffiness, Rhino, bring out Kaleido, and then Kaleido effect, spin back the token, that's going to out the Draco back, we have Heartbeat to out Fateful, so that way they have no, like, Griffin access, uh, so we can out that, we have Solik with Kaleido, which is multiple interruptions, we have Scream, Huffiness, so pushing through this is just so hard. They draw Terraforming, and just submit the feet and leave, they realize that they have lost, so we're going to see how long the match was. Uh, I mean, they didn't even know about Solik, right? They only knew about Heartbeat. Right? Yeah, they didn't know about Solik. I don't know. I guess maybe they just gave up. Do they not have... No, they still have a planet in deck. Alright, uh, we're going to see if the match was only about 20 minutes long. And Armageddon YGO does end up winning. Kind of destroyed their opponent there. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be the last not post mama replay and everything here from you know here on out is going to be post mama uh, My bad on that one. So I probably should have checked before kind of kind of realized when I saw Rhoda but Yeah, with all that being said the DV grinder signing off peace. Have a nice day. Stay safe